Howdy guys, welcome back to Let's Play Banjo-Tooie. We just left the train station at Hailfire Peaks, now I'm gonna float over here. And, uh, let's see, this is gonna be tricky. There's a tunnel just down from us, it's like the second one over. The first one's covered by bricks, it's kinda hard to see. You can see the first one. The one just after it is the one we're trying to get into. Yes, this one. This is the other switch, which, uh, goes back to that pain in the ass jiggy I was talking about earlier. The Banjo stepped on the first switch for that, and Kazooie just now stepped on the second one, but now there's a third one, and Banjo's gonna have to step on that. So, let us make way. Let us make way. Just gonna use the grip grab ledge here, not taking any chances. And you could technically jump to it, and then just grab, like, and, uh, you know, pull yourself across the last fourth of it or something, but it's better to do it this way. So that's the third switch, and that will open the Jiggy. This jiggy has never made sense to me. Like, I'm, just, I, don't, I almost wonder if there's like other ways to do it, but I think that's the only way to do it. That just seems so complicated, though. I don't know. Anyway, switch back to Kazooie. We can get down to it from here. Yep. There you go. So we'll pick up the jiggy, and right next door is the Coliseum that links back to the Dodgeball Coliseum from the first world. You might remember. We'll be coming and doing some stuff here later. I'm not going to do anything just yet. But um, there's a switch in here. It's, kind of, it's really dark in here. It's kind of hard to find your way around. Uh, that's the column with the... Here we go. Yes! I was hoping I'd find the switch. Um, yeah, so when you hit this switch right here, it opens up three little things down there, which leads to what appears to be a Jinjo. More on that later. Okay, sorry guys, I had to cut there. Um, I was, I knew there was some boots in here and it took me forever to find them. It turns out they're right next to the switch. Jeez, I must have looked all over this room for like three minutes. But yeah, the boots right next to the switch. Just go grenade egg the wall, pick them up, and climb up this column here. Right next to the switch, you can get to the top here. So, uh, I didn't want you to have to watch me walking all around that room, because that was... Man, I tell you, I was starting to wonder if those things existed. Yeesh. So we come out here, we're gonna get a Cheeto page. Now I'm gonna do something really cheap. Which is, I'm gonna kill myself. Because it's just gonna take too long with Kazooie and Banjo where they're at right now. It'll take forever to get them back where we want them to be, but if you kill yourself, it'll take you both back to the last split pads that you were at. Which is gonna save a little time here. Actually, a lot of time. <laughs> you have no idea. So now, uh... Okay, I think I know what I wanna do. Alright, so we need to take Kazooie, and we need to go down from here. There's a door right here. And inside this door, well, uh, let's see. If I'm not mistaken, this leads... Oh god, yeah, it does. At least, I hate this room. Okay, so you basically... Yeah, see, I'm already burning myself. You got six switches in a row you need to hit here. But you have to hit them in the right order, and you have to hit one for the next one to come up. And just running around in here is such a pain in the ass. I don't trust myself with this thing, but I'm actually lucky I got that switch there. And the next one always has to appear, like, seemingly on the opposite end of the room. So, And then you have the timer, too. You notice my bubble's on the left side of the screen. You can only stay in here for so long because it's hot. I don't know if Dragon Kazooie um, loses energy slower because, you know, dragons and hot stuff is kind of... Ugh. Jeez, I don't know how I hit that just now. That was not happening. Uh, five. Where the hell was that one? Shit! 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 Uh, blah, 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 blah. Get out of the lava. Find somewhere to get out of the lava. Okay, right here, right here, right here, right here. Just anywhere, anywhere, right now. Oh man, I have no idea where I'm. Okay, there it is. Wait, no, that's the. Yeah, it's right there. Excuse me. Ugh. Oh my god, I just. <laughs> Jeez, I just panicked there for a second, like, oh my god, what am I doing? And finally, the sixth switch, which is actually going to have a Jiggy symbol on it, and it will make a Jiggy appear, but we have to get to it first. So, just do a couple of uh, backflip jumps here. Seems to be the best way to do it. <sighs> Boom, Earth shakes, and there's your Jiggy. And, uh, two columns open up over there. That's strange. Well, we're not going to be going there yet, either. Because I ain't interested. Oh, I am so going to die. I just know it. Crap. Crap. Where is that, um... 
Oh, that's not where I wanted to go! <laughs> There's an entrance... Uh, hang on. Okay, I'm back. See that entrance in the distance? That blue door way back there? That's where I want to go. And that'll take us to the ice side of this world, which we haven't seen yet, so... It's time to do it! Oh, oh, oh. See, now I'm getting careless. They're on me, and I'm getting careless. Jesus. Well, that was pretty much inevitable. From five seconds before it happened, you knew that was inevitable. So get over here to this thing right here. That's what I'm trying to do. Now we're going to the ice side. Ice side of Hailfire Peaks. Haven't seen this yet. Duh. I think I said that already. Probably said it three times. This is the Icicle Grotto. So we're going to take a right here, and this will take us outside to the main part of the ice world. So far, the lag doesn't seem to be too bad. That's pretty good. Oh, no. Scanners indicate location of kids' evacuation found. Exterior door. Opening to enable manual viewing. Get some more toilet paper. Detecting Earthling crosswind. Be careful. Yeah, it's cold here. Oh. Yikes. I calculate it's a long way down. That's right, Goo Goo Dolls. Huh? What, what's going on? Keep ship steady. What are they doing over there? Oh no! No, 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 no! Activate jetpack! Well, speaking of jetpacks, uh, never mind. Oh, never mind, I'm okay. Wait, wait a minute. No, I'm not. I'm dead. Sorry for just reading the text here. I, don't know, I could come up with something more creative to say, I'm sure. I love how the camera just zooms away from him like he really is dead. So we gotta move here, we're gonna learn with Kazooie Solo. That's why I wanted to take her here instead of where I was supposed to go in that other room. This is a very useful move, too, this glide. Basically, it's like flying, except you can't go up, you can't gain any height, but you descend really slowly with it, so... Very useful. So, we come into the Icicle Grotto, we go across to the other side, and down here is a treble cliff, as soon as I get rid of these guys. You can barely see it from here, but you can glide to it pretty well. Right there. Holy crap, what did I just do? Oh, man! Okay, I'm back. Let's try that again. Without the oops. Good lord. Oh, oops right there. So we got the glide. Let's go to the treble cliff and let's make it this time. There we go. So, burn it out. Burn it alive. Okay, here we go. Oh, shoot. I should have done a backflip jump. Now I can't get to that Jinjo. Ugh. I want that Jinjo. This is the only good time to get him. Um. Ugh. Can I get... Maybe I can get back to that platform I was at or something. Uh, I'm gonna try to get back over there again. Wait, wait, what, 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 what? Okay, guys, we're back again. We're at the platform now. I'm gonna get this Jiggy, or this Jinjo this time. Thank you. See how useful this is? Very useful indeed. All you gotta do is hold Z. So I didn't really read the directions very well, and he was explaining it to me. So now we just keep going down the cavern, pretty much all the way down to the bottom. What the hell? Dude, no way! Uh, well, I guess we went down to the bottom, all right, didn't we? Okay, guys, we're back again. How many times am I gonna fail this thing? Okay, so we got a war point over here to the left. I skipped what well, to the right because we've already been there. So, holy crap. What the hell? Dude! Dude! Why did he bounce off that way? Uh, okay, let's try this again. Now, we made it across the time. There was the warp point. That warp point is actually pretty useless. I didn't have to grab it, but but I'm going to anyway. So on your way down here, you're going to want to watch for... Uh, just before the last exit, there's a, a room here with a ledge up high that you're going to want to get... Uh, you don't want to shoot a clockwork egg. And you actually have to do this, too. Like, this may seem like clockwork abuse, but no. You have to get this this way. This Cheeto page behind the ice over here? Crap. There's, there's like a ton... Okay, here we go. I think I screwed this up. You actually have to go to the next room. I wasn't in the last room. Sorry about that. <laughs> there are going to be more abrupt cuts in this video, I swear to God. Ugh. Anyway, so, dude, get out of my way. There's a legend here. You shoot a clockwork Kazooie egg up to it. It's right there. 
There you go. Now I'll just look around for a tunnel in the wall. There you go. Follow the tunnel, it'll take us to the Cheeto page that we saw in the previous room. I just wasn't in the last room, that's why I couldn't find the ledge. I also looked around for that for like two minutes. Anyway, let's blow the bomb. We got the Cheeto page, we're good. So, let's get out of here.